Hello everyone. <clears throat> Welcome back to my YouTube channel. We're working more on my RPG Maker program project. Sorry for the um, abrupt cut at the end earlier today. But when family calls, you got kind of got to answer. So, but we are back. And I am going to try to finish <coughs> what I have left in this video. Hopefully. No guarantees though. Alright, so I left off over there. Let's just zoom back in. Alright. Mm hmm hmm. Go ahead and put some of this down. I did add some more games to my Steam wish list. I had them in there before. I removed them because of um YouTube problems with false copyright claims. But I went ahead and re-added them because why not? There's something to play, and I'm I'm a fan of the series anyway. Well, not the newer ones. The newer ones are um well the wrong combat style, in my opinion. But that's just my opinion. Everyone else seems to love the new combat style that the franchise is using. I, however, do not love it. It is, it just doesn't fit. Which is very unfortunate. But it is what it is. No idea whenever I will get to that series though. <coughs> I am also kind of reluctant on giving the company money because as I knew, they were more into um, NFTs and blockchains, microtransactions, and I do not condone that at all. I, um, yeah, I don't approve of that nonsense crap. <sighs> so I am kind of reluctant on giving them money because of that stuff, but it is what it is. I just won't be buying anything newer from them. So don't expect a certain episodic remake that is actually already done. They're just claiming it's not done. And if that wasn't enough clues to tell you what franchise it is, well, you're an idiot. So I'm just to it. All right. <laughs> and if you guys are wondering if my game is going to have any of that crap in it, no, because I don't condone it. No cosmetics, no microtransactions of any kind because they don't belong in video games the only video games that stuff belongs in is like MMOs but not well yeah just MMOs in general nothing else so that's how MMORPGs stay afloat that's how they keep their servers going Call of Duty and all that stuff or the EA sports games and all of them, they don't need it. It's just corporate greed. That's all it is. The only DLC that I plan on doing is, hopefully if I'm able to, is a DLC sequel. No guarantees I will ever do that because who knows if I'm able to. I don't, I don't know if a DLC sequel's ever been done before. 
But if it has, that's fine. Cool. But I'm not going to guarantee that I will be able to do it because it could be something that Steam or Xbox or Sony, if I ever do get that far in this process, won't allow. Who knows? I'm not saying they don't, but it could be something that they will not allow. So... We will see if, you know, if it can happen. Because I would rather have the, C the sequels be a, a, a DLC than a separate game. Because to me, it makes more sense. You're paying for a deal for a, a sequel. Why not make it a DLC? Like, and make it a full length DLC the same length as the original game. Don't make it like a two hour or 30 minute DLC. If you have a game that is 200 hours long, then make the sequel the same length as a DLC. Like, mm, like, like, come on. That's what I want out of DLCs is the same length. I don't want DLCs that are, oh, you pay 20 bucks for, like, okay, Borderlands, great series, but you buy a DLC from Borderlands, and it's only, like, 30 minutes long, and you pay 20 bucks for it, not worth it. I'm sorry, it's not worth it. That DLC should be 20 hours long, one for one. That's how you get your value. If you don't get one for one, then it's not worth your value. If you get more than what the game is priced at, then that's good. That game was priced perfectly. But if you only get like 10 hours for a $60 game, then that $60 game is technically 10 bucks. It's not worth 60 bucks. I don't care. How much money they spent on making the game is only worth 10 bucks, one for one. That's how you value games. You get one hour per one dollar. And if you guys want to argue with me on that, you can leave my channel. I don't care. Well, hi, Mr. Kitty. I'm busy, okay? So lay down, buddy. Hey, hey, lay down, buddy, okay? Be a good boy. Be a good boy. Hey. Come here. You're okay. You're not in trouble. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, shit. Sorry, guys. My cat's on the table. What are you doing, bud? Lay down, buddy. Hey, I can see your butthole. I can see your butt. Hey, you're mooning me. Be a good boy. Be a good boy, okay? Hi. Hi, Mr. Kitty. That's not going to work. What are you doing up here, buddy? Did I wake you up for my talking and stuff, huh, buddy? Oh, Mr. Kitty. My little buddy. My little baby boy. You heard the voices outside, don't you, buddy? And as for the length of my game, oh, I have no idea how long it'll be. I'll figure that, that out once I play through it myself. And no, I will not play it on recording. <laughs> I don't want to ruin the whole thing. Well, I'm basically going to ruin it while I'm making it, but there probably will be some things that I don't record. Maybe. I don't know yet. We'll see. I'm not at that point yet. I'm still in the first stage of making the game. And that's 
what you guys see now, which is mapping. And that will take quite a while to do. Which is fine, I don't care. I mean, I've never been past. How far did I get many years ago? Before my hard drive crashed because of the USB that had. I had like, I think, 20 maps drawn. And then I went to play test it. Turns out it wasn't all done correctly because I was still learning the program. So everything just broke. Was, you know, whatever, it happens. You know, you're learning the program. You're not sure what to do. You just slap things together over a course of X amount of time. You find out all your stuff that you put together is broken. That royally pisses you off. Because <laughs> you think it's done right and it's not. You know, it happens. And you basically just give up from there. And in your heart and in your hard drive crashes as well. So yeah, I mean and you, that's when you learn to back things up. <laughs> Which I would back this up on the cloud, but for some reason my laptop and my computer I have at home they sync but they won't sync this. Like, what's up, buddy? What's wrong? You got food and water. I'll give you off the couch. Hey, no. Off the couch. Off. Good boy. But for some reason, they won't sync this. They won't sync the save in the cloud. So I said, screw the cloud. I'll just buy you a speed. And every now and then, like once a month or whatever, I'll move the save from the USB onto my actual computer for both. That way it's backed up. So, yeah, I don't know what I'm doing wrong. I don't know if it's user error for a cloud or if it's just the cloud being a dick. But for some reason, it will not take the save on my home computer and transfer it to my laptop or vice versa I don't like it won't take any of the changes I make at all so I, I don't know I gave up on that whole cloud thing because of that it does it does everything else though if I install a game on my home computer was this for gaming it installs it on my laptop but it won't take any changes from this to my laptop and vice and vice versa. It makes no sense. It makes no sense. And that's what the cloud is for is to transfer files from the internet. But it won't do that. So I said screw it, I'll just go buy a twenty dollar USB Problem solved. Save me the hassle of dealing with a broken system. Even if it is possible user error, which I doubt it is, but it probably is. Put down some leaves because, you know, gotta symbolize that wind that does blow in this world. No, not there. I already got enough over there. Good lord. Uh, there's some more over here now. Add me some bushes, big beans. No, not there. That's in the middle of the um, walkway. What one like right there as well? Yeah, I'll put one there.
No, I'm not there. It looks awkward. No, that's not that's not how I mean I guess they could grill there, but not in not in my world. Ugh, fudge. Can't even see that. Alright, I wanna do a hard save now. <coughs> so I don't accidentally hit undo. I need to raise stuff. Even after I save. Okay, that's fine there, because I can walk over that. Oh my lord, dude, I got. Eh. So my next goal, or my next idea after this, which I'm sure you guys have already figured out, involves this building right here. And I am leaning towards using tile set D, which you all know what is in tile set D if you don't. You will find out what is in there. And if you don't know what's in there, it means you are new to my channel. And hi. <laughs> if you are new to my channel. Did I hit undo? No, I did not. Okay, I hit save. And if you are new to my channel, and you like seeing this process, even though it is, for now, just making maps and not... And not the other process, which, what are you doing, buddy? You got water in your bowl. Go look. And food. I know your water's getting low. I'll give you some tonight, okay? I actually might go ahead and um, set this one up. Maybe... next week if I'm able or next weekend uh, and maybe next weekend I'm recording and I'll show you guys that process for those of you who don't know how to do it and that's probably all I will yeah that's actually all I will set up because I know how I want that map to be set up. The rest of it, I have no idea for now. Because I've never gotten that far. <laughs> and that's me being completely honest on it, like 100% honest. Oh, why am I so tired now? Good Lord, I think I need a coffee. Oh wait, I don't have coffee. I don't like coffee unless it's from a certain place. Because coffee is disgusting. Sorry if you're a coffee drinker, but... I don't like coffee unless it's from a certain place. Because straight black coffee? Gross. No matter what you do to it, doesn't help. I can put all of the creamer and sugar in it I want and milk in it I want. It's still just black coffee. But if I go to a certain place that makes it for five bucks, my God. It does not taste like coffee at all. It tastes better than coffee. Now, I do like Starbucks Frappuccinos, but I'd rather support a small mom and pop store over them because they get enough business as it is they don't need my 10 bucks to stay afloat <laughs> they get enough people spending 10 bucks on coffee every day as it is they don't need me to help them at all
There is, oh, I mean, I could, but hey, why not? I might get some chocolate milk, see if that helps after this video. I doubt it will, though. There's not enough caffeine and chocolate milk to even bother with. <laughs> That's not how that works. It looks cool, but... It's not how that works, I'm sorry. Alright, so that part is now done. We got how many more to go? I mean, we're, we're getting there. Yeah, I know we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You know, I can do this. You know, no problem, dude. You know, I, I can do it. Yeah, I can do it. Seven more? Shoot. That's not bad at all, dude. And then I'll probably... put a cut in the video here and either continue on with this or... more Wasteland 3 because I am enjoying that game. I took a break from it for a couple months to avoid burnout, and now I want to play it again. <clears throat> oh, I took a break from video gaming in general because, you know, burnout to avoid it. I still play games here and there, but there are times when I just, I don't play video games all the time to avoid burnout. I think there was like a whole year where I didn't play video games. Like at all. Well, I'm not, I, I did, but not like hardcore. Maybe like an hour or two a day. And that was it. If that. And I'm someone who would literally sit here all day, every day and play games. For me to not play games for six hours a day or more every day. Yeah, <laughs> I was burned out. <laughs> I knew, well that was before I got a PC as well so that explains it I was on console back then no good games on console I'm sorry and I even Nintendo Switch and if you're a Nintendo Switch user I'm sorry <laughs> I'm sorry but you gotta deal with that nonsense every time you play a game Seeing the rough, jagged edges of all the games you play. When Nintendo can in fact make a console that is up to par with Xbox and, and Sony. But they refuse to. It's like, why Nintendo? You make great consoles. They're cool designs, but you refuse to put the hardware in them. To make them badass. <laughs> or you could just do what um, Sega did. And quit making consoles. All oh hey that's a great idea Nintendo. Please do that. <laughs> and then put all your games on everything. Then you wouldn't have to sue anymore. Think about it Nintendo. You would get more money. Because your, your games would be on everything else. They would have better graphics than what you guys are willing to do. You wouldn't have to worry about wasting money on suing people for emulation anymore. Because there wouldn't be a need for it anymore. Think about it. It's a win-win for everyone. Even you. <laughs> if you're too damn lazy... To make consoles up to snuff with your other competitors. Why not do what Sega did? Quit making consoles and let's make games. I mean, that's what I would do. Save you money on lawsuits. People can quit emulating your games. To play them at their best performance. It's a win-win for everyone. 
Hell, I would start buying Nintendo games again if they were on PC. I would buy Nintendo games if they were on PC. If, if Nintendo literally had a Nintendo store where you can buy PC, if you can buy PC versions of Nintendo games, I would play their games on PC. Instead of going out on the internet and downloading an emulator and buying, getting a, a ROM for older games. Why can't Nintendo do that? Xbox does it. Sony, I think, is possibly going to do it eventually. Maybe. Hopefully one day. That would be great. Because then if that happens, I'll play Sony games. I mean, they've already started putting their games on, on Steam. Why can't Nintendo follow suit? Think about it, Nintendo. You make more money that way. <laughs> I mean, you're already in the lead of the console wars. Why not get a bigger lead? And make more money. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> it's called marketing geniuses. You guys are marketing geniuses. You make consoles that are fucking amazing. Whoever is your idea man is a fucking genius. <laughs> I swear, like, where do they come up with the ideas for the GameCube or the Wii or the Switch? Like, they went from the 64 to the GameCube, and they're like, you know what? Let's make a new console, but let's make it a, a small little cube where the disc is, like... A small little, the same size as a plastic cup lid, as a as a small plastic to go cup lid, and everyone's like, "That's fucking genius." Where do they get these ideas? Like, I, I, I I'm being serious. Where do they get their brilliant console ideas? And then they put such shitty hardware in them. It, it's it, it it dumbfounds me. Their badass consoles would be even more badass if they put badass hardware in them. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I love Nintendo, but goddamn. <laughs> They have the money to do so as well because they're always in the lead. So, like, why not spend that extra money they have over everyone else to put badass hardware in their badass consoles? Like, they, they could easily do it. it. It just, it makes no sense to me at all. It really does not make sense. I'm honestly waiting to see what the next console is. I'm actually curious to find out what it is. I'm hoping that they'll either A, step up their hardware game, their hardware in their next console or B and I'm leaning and I'm hoping they'll do B or B they'll announce that they're stepping away from consoles in general and that they're going to do what Sega did and just start making games for all platforms that's what I want them to do if they refuse to if they continue to refuse to put better hardware in their consoles But I know they won't do that because, you know, it's Nintendo. They have always won the console wars and they will continue to do so. But they would win even more if they put all their games on every platform. But they won't because, you know, it's Nintendo.
But again, whoever the hell their idea man is, give him a freaking pay raise, I swear. <laughs> they went from the Nintendo, Super Nintendo, 64, then the, then the GameCube. Then the Wii, the Wii U, and then the Switch. The guy is a fucking genius. <laughs> I mean... That guy is a freaking genius. Like, back then on the, on the Nintendo, Duck Hunt. Duck Hunt, you actually had to use a fake gun and aim it at the screen. And how that gun works, if you don't know... If you're younger than I am and you have no idea how that gun worked, look it up. That gun, that game, was like the 80s. The technology they used for that gun back then to make it work, phenomenal for the first time. Look that shit up. <laughs> look that shit up. Their idea, man, whoever the hell he is, deserves the freaking pay raise. <laughs> Whoever he is, man, he oh my god, the, I, mm. <laughs> Japan, I swear, they are smarter than Americans. I'm saying it now. Well, it's obvious because they go to school six days a week. They have crown school. They have homework during breaks. Here in America, we go to school four days a week, and that's it. So no wonder Japan is smarter than we are. I kind of want to move there. <clears throat> because of how their education is. So if I have any children, they'll get the best education possible versus here in America. Because American education sucks ass. I said no, I was part of it. The whole no child left behind nonsense has to go, I'm sorry. It has to go. Using computers in school has to go. Ugh. And if I'm offending anyone right now, leave my channel and never come back. I don't give a fuck. I really don't give a fuck at all. You can leave my channel and never come back. You can report me to YouTube and try to get my channel shut down for all I care. I don't care. I'm stating the facts about our shitty country that is known as America. I don't like this country at all anymore. I never have for a long time. I have not liked it for a long time. It has, not, it has gone downhill for a very long time. <laughs> And I'm stating the facts right now. <coughs> That's why I want out. <laughs> but I can't afford to get out. And it sucks. I'm stuck here in this shitty country. <laughs> it sucks. I probably shouldn't have said that on recording, but you know what? I don't care. I'm stating the facts. Freedom. Oh wait, that's taken away too. Oh yeah. Look at journalism. Look at um news. All that's the same shit, no matter where you go. I didn't put that down, but honestly, I don't really care right now. I want to get this done and move on to something else. Uh, let's see here. No, I mean, I could, but not up here. On um, the bigger trees, I haven't done those yet. And if I offended anyone by saying what I feel about 
what, about what how I feel. Grow up, grow up, honestly. You can get the fuck out of my channel, never come back. I'm just gonna leave it there. No, nope, that's not how that goes. All right, that's done now. <clears throat> now for this one, now for a new map. Or new maps, basically. How about, yeah, a new map. Um, it'd be a house. Well, I want to do that in the next video, not this one. All right, I am done for now. I want to do something else. I will see you all later. And again, if I offended anyone, you know what the door is. Never come back. Goodbye.